Alright, I don't think I can keep molten, Mountain Giant uh, against a zoo, potential zoo. Loot Hoarder is actually really good. He kept his whole hand. Scary. No? Still thinking. Supposing he were to replace his entire hand, I might keep Mountain Giant. But not really outside of that. Welcome Wicked to Valley Town. One card. Man. Whoa. No turn one play. He kept two cards. So, he's got something early. Looks like he's hand luck. So this mountain giant is great. How much gold should I save for next? Well, I am making my own personal assumption that the wings are going to cost a thousand gold apiece. I don't know uh, how much validity there is to that, so you can make your judgment based off of that. Why do I think we don't see a lot of hunters? What changes can be made so that we see more of them? Well, if there were more frost mages around, uh, then... Hunters would be really good. You see them occasionally, and I think they're a viable deck. So nothing really wrong at the moment, I'd say. I can play the Mountain Giant if I sack this. I think I should do that. Welcome Gazup to Valley Town. I'll probably Frostbolt Ice Lance Fire Blast that. Um. Black and nice. Then again, this is uh, 3, 7, 11, 17 damage. So he's at 7 health if I don't use any of this burn. I would like to keep it that way. I do have a Molten Giant, so perhaps taking... Uh, fireball him. It's insane. Prowl's Full Ice Lance Fire Blast. It does only have 5 cards left, so... His plays are pretty limited. I'll go for the longer game. I would have much preferred to have a uh, Mirror Image or Frost Nova and Doomsayer. That would have been pretty nice. My eyes are open. Let the pain speak to me. Archmage coin ice lance. It's not bad. You require my assistance. Job done. So many possible. As is uh as goes all the handlock matchups, I anticipate this one. And in a fiery fashion. An explosive fashion. So I've got 18 damage in hand. Um, so far in this game, I've burned one Frostbolt and Fire or Frostbolt Ice Lance. That was the second Ice Lance. So that's the. So I have two more. Fi no, I have one more Fireball in this deck. Hit, Fireball, Fire Blast. What to do? What to do? Or I could just do 12 damage to him, put him at nine, and then do nine more to him. He's a uh, Played an Earthen and a Siphon. Hmm. That play loses to... Actually, so this is 12, uh, 21. No, it's too close. Yeah, as I'm entered into the MSI tournament on the 5th of July. What is a good strategy for picking the three decks? 
Uh, you should have a deck which is generally good against most everything. Druid's a popular choice. And then, like, two of two decks which are good against the field. Uh, one of which covers the weakness of the other deck. That's just general strategy. And play decks you're good at. played a lot of his threats, other than the Moltens, and the Twilight Drakes. Is this his third giant of the mountain variety? One of them was faceless. I think so. I the Flame Strike is too good. It rarely hits this much stuff. Go to Frostball for that. My shield for Argus! Oh, that one health boost is really bad for me. What to do? And yet, to I believe do. I must fireball it, or I can play the mirror image. Uh, if you shadow flames this thing, then the double image goes away. I take the nine. I go down to eight, to do? and what Leroy plus Soulfire kills me. He hasn't used any Soulfires yet. So, I'll assume one of my plays is going to be the Fireball. Which means I have to go pretty much directly Mountain Giant Fireball. What to do? What to do? Time runs out on me. Bummer. Keeps a mirror of image around, since I got a molten. Total biscuit spouting the wisdom here. Double Hellfire? Nah, Soulfire? Wait, what? Okay. Well, that was expensive. I'm gonna play Mirror Image here. Kinda scared. And all the AoE has been used. Not all of it, but a lot of it. That's pretty good. Oh, what I really want is... Ice block, of course. There it is. I hope you like my invention. I forgot about playing mirror image. <sighs> yeah, I, I need to play ice block. Um, novice drew the mirror. Okay, so I guess I didn't. Oh, but I had one. I think mirror image might have been better than ice block in that particular turn. My shield for Argus. Yeah, looks like it didn't matter though. I might try a mirror image doomsayer. It's uh, quite a bit more risky than just frost nova doomsayer, but frost nova could be really good against the giant slayer. Also, I am uh, one damage short of winning. Wait, no, I'm a lot more than that. Oh, wait. I'm gonna go with the more secure option here. The end is coming! With uh, all the AoE removed, the mirror images could be incredibly huge. I bring life. 
That looks pretty secure. Oh, wow. It's gotten down to two cards left on a handlock deck. I haven't had that happen very often. But I think Rag can fit in an Aggro Priest deck. Mm -hmm. I mean, Rag fits in a Control Priest deck, like Amaz is showing, so... an Aggro one, of course. Okay. That's gotta be all of the area of effect. Of course, given that he's only got two cards left in the deck. I imagine he's gotten most. Almost out of time. Okay, I'm now actually one damage away from winning. Mirror image could block eight damage here. It's pretty sweet. I'm almost out of cards. This has been quite a game. Shields up. I want to keep both. I don't think I've ever had the uh, situation come out where I've had both. Probably because adding the second one is a recent addition. I'd rather have a two card draw. I think the card is good enough. In this matchup. The light protects me. Oh, it's aggro. This hand is terrible. Ugh. It's too slow to spend four mana to kill the Ar Argent Squire. And I'm afraid of the Dagger Mastery coming in and hitting Thalnus, but it might prevent him from playing something. Voluntarily, as an aggro deck, charged into my card which wants to draw two cards. That is incorrect. Let the pain speak to me. I hope he does it again. Oh crap! Oh crap! Okay, well here's the My thing, they think they're being clever by doing this, but the burning of the cards doesn't matter too much against an aggro deck, because the goal really is just to draw in the good stuff and then stay alive. Well, I suppose that I should have recognized that and maybe instead of playing Acolyte I'd play Ice Block here. Oh well. All well, those cards burned end up not being very important in this matchup. I think that's the fault of playing this deck. It's not supposed to be like a mill deck. That's like the secondary cute condition. I think by doing that, he's actually helped me by quite a lot. And there's like no critical cards in this matchup, I think. Well, no critical cards that aren't in my hand already. Oh, okay. You're adorable. I think I'm getting the good side of the discards, also. I should have played Ice Block on turn 3, or 4.
Oh my gosh. Ah, this guy's toast. My hand is too full. Okay, now I'm starting to get annoyed. <laughs> That's actually pretty good. The fortunate thing is the random discards did not hit Alex Straza. This game was a lot of RNG. Oh my gosh, I have no place. Gross. Wait, did he hit Alex Strauss? No, he didn't. I would have noticed. I hope. Mind if I roll need? Ha, this guy's toast. Mind if I roll need? Nice. I bring life. Well, I'm not going to deny that if the discards had happened a different way. I wouldn't have won. And yet, I'm not entirely sure about this strat, because it could already be holding in the hand. Alright, Arcane Int makes this cost 4, it'll cost 3 next turn. Lovely. Time to play Dodge That Hunter. The game where you dodge the game hunter. Uh, do I want to play Mirror Image? It's at its worst against a two attack guy. I wonder. Uh, next turn, what am I going to play? I seem to just have a lot of cards in hand. All right. I play that only because I have no other play on the next turn. It's one of those first world problems, I have too many cards in hand, might as well toss this one out there for small benefit. That is a lot of burn. I wonder if I just start fireballing his face. I've got um, 12, 15, 18, 22 points of burn here. Attack him, fireball his face. I wonder. <sighs> Crazy. I am the second player. Hmm. You possibly won't get a turn seven. No, no, he'll get to turn seven first. And then he can play Ancient of Lore. I think the more secure thing to do is fireball the Azure Drake. But. No, no, to Frostbolt the Azure Drake. Of course. Time runs out on me.
Definitely entertain the uh, thought of just unloading on him starting on turn five. A little too yellow. Time waits for no one. It's so nice when they don't have the big game hunter. Why doesn't this happen all the time? Well played. To Northrend! Welcome, Teal Lidson to Valley Town. I think I'll play a mirror image here. It blocks enough damage. It's looking to block four. At least. Looks to block six. And that's a bargain. I'll probably fireball Yete there. The Molten Giants are going to be somewhat awkward to cast. Oh, actually, Dooms... no, Doomsayer. This could make him hit me to 18, which is nice. I'll also Fire Blast this guy. It might matter. Okay, the good news is by seeing that Ancient of War, it does mean that he is not running for Savage, in theory. So I'll Flame Strike here, and the next turn I will uh, pull off the Fireball Double Molten. Maybe. Okay, and also Ice Lance one of them. That's quite a turn. Who dares to find land? I hope you like my invention. Oh, a mirror image. That could be really good. Could be. We for vengeance. Time runs out on me. Okay. 
Gotta live on a bit of a hope here. But in the case that these eight ones don't die to a random swipe, uh, killing that other tree is gonna be okay. None shall. Okay, that's promising. Yes. <laughs> Oh, is that better? That's really good. Wait, can I? Oh, man! Woo! Yes! I think. Yes, I mean that's strictly better. Although I don't immediately win. Oh, I win. Eight. Oh my gosh. Wait. Six. Nine. Seventeen. Wow. 